Hello, welcome to Irvine Natural Preserve. We are in Quail Hill today. It's a very easy short hike. It's about two miles, two miles and a half. I'm not even sure. It's family friendly. It's right in the middle of the city, but yet beautiful. Parking lot is free, but do be mindful uh, on a sunny day. It's going to be packed with people, so you need to come early. Let's go. Let's do it. The trailhead is right over there on the parking lot. Okay, so I'm not even gonna give any instruction as far as where to go. Either left or right, does not matter, it's a loop. But as you can see, it's actually pretty nice. It is a rainy day, so I will not see a lot of people today. I just saw a mule deer with a male running away all the way to the top of that hill. I did not have a chance to record. But all of that to say that even though we're in the middle of the city and right next to the 405 freeway uh, You can see deers over there Sadly, I couldn't record it, but maybe we might be able to see some more deers later on so really one of the highlights of the hike is that little viewpoint And as you can see, it's going to give us a view all over Quill Hill itself. So you can see the meadow. This is the preserve. And it's going to give you a view on the freeway, on the 405 and a little bit the city of Irvine. Already almost midway through the hike. And this is what we get. I wish videos could uh, send the smell it's uh, it smells wonderful right now that smell of uh, dry grass that's just being rained on uh, i love that smell obviously that place is even more beautiful in spring when everything is green wildflowers and all the stuff but it's a nice little walk it's a nice easy little walk as mentioned a while back, I saw a mule deer today, so you might see some. I know that place has bobcats too, and I, I know that place also has rattlesnakes. Be mindful of that. You will obviously not see one a day like today, and it's usually a trailhead with a lot of people. A lot of people on the trail, so it's very unlikely you will see one directly. So there it is. We came from the other side. And this is what the loop is all about. We come this way, coming right over there. And the parking lot is this way, so we're just gonna finish it. It's a very easy hike, two miles and a half. But it's amazing to come here with kids, and I love that place myself. And I'm sorry, we are right next to the 405 freeway. That being said, I just wanted to show very quick the second spot on the hike, which is a seasonal pond. It's dry right now because we had such a dry winter. But basically that place becomes a pond when it rains a lot. A pond that's gonna fill in with frogs, toads, tadpoles, bunch of birds and uh, wildlife. And it's actually pretty amazing to see how a spot that can be so dry all of a sudden just starts teeming with life. So I'm just gonna finish the hike. It's almost the end of the trail. I know it's a very easy one, but again, it's a rainy day. I didn't wanna go too far. This is it, this is it, almost the end of the trail. So that part of the hike in spring after the rain gets covered in wildflowers and you need to imagine the spot being all green, a bunch of tall grass, a bunch of golden fields, a bunch of uh, beautiful wildflowers and it's really nice. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, do stop by Quail Hill if you have a minute. It's an amazing hike for families. It's short, it's easy and yet you still get to see a bunch of beautiful stuff right next to the city.